Look at the size of this man. He's number nine, he's the top scorer in the Premier League, and he's an absolute worldie. I mean, he boasts pretty impressive dribbling and ball control, he's got five star skills. Nice. He's absolutely massive, he's got acrobatic flair trait. This guy is the next Ebra. He's an absolute maverick. And just to back it up as well, he's got the, ma he got the maverick personality trait, which is his dominant role at the moment in the team, as well as being a heartbeat. So lads, we are indeed back for another video on the channel today. Sorry it's been so long since an upload, but we've had massive technical issues as uh, for some reason our game like created a ghost profile. That doesn't make sense. And we couldn't play the game at all. We haven't got to play Ultimate Team or anything for the last week. And uh, it's just been a nightmare to be honest with you. But we do indeed return today with episode 5 of this player career mode with our man H Junior, hoping to impress the, impress the Denmark scouts as they have come in to watch us. We're still English currently in the save because we've got the chance to represent them internationally, but we want to represent Denmark, obviously the, the birth origin of our parents. So yeah, we're going to go for that. What the fuck are you talking about, man? As I say, we've got Man United to start off with, obviously the Red Devils at Old Trafford. Difficult opposition with partnering Amduani up front. That's our team on your right hand side, just above my floating head. And uh, I mean, it's, it's not a bad team to be fair, but United, I mean, doesn't show player player balls anymore, which is a bit of a shame. But yeah, it's a fantastic team. Let's get into this gameplay. Massive, massive game ahead. Here we are. We're looking at the Stratford and the David De Gea Tifo, Old Trafford. Massive, massive game in prospect. Seventh versus eighth, I think. It's a big game anyway. And uh, we'll see the boys being let out. I think we've got kickoff to start off with. Come on, you villains. We need a win in this one. All right, so we kick off, obviously. Amduani partner is up, up front, as we said earlier on. We need a fast start in this game. And, um, I mean, no better game to play against the Red Devils at Old Trafford. Come on, Bertrand. Oh, he's actually done really well there. Ah, Varan, you rat. Good side, United, to be fair. They are, they are a good side on FIFA. I mean, not so much in real life. As they have a shot, they hit the crossbar. And um, my remote seems to be making noises. Fantastic. Hey, nobody cares. Nobody cares. Find us. Oh, go on, I see that run. I see that run. That's lovely play, to be fair. Go on, mate. Back stick. Oh, I'll have it back if you need, actually. Oh, such a good play by Amduani. Go on. Go on. Go on. Oh, look at that play. Shot against De Gea. It's a good save just before half time. And I suggest, indeed it is, the final attack of the half. Not a lot happening so far. I might even show any highlights in that. But very, very difficult first half. They're man-marking me. Go on. No, 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 no. Lataro's making that run. You've got to press him, lads. You can't let him have that much space. Tackle him, for God's sake. Oh, my God. That is such a woefully defended goal. I think it was Esri Concer. Just left him to do what he wanted to do. And uh, United take the lead, undeservedly. Excellent passing. Oh, come on, not a second, Lataro. Challenge him. Oh, look at the state of this defending. Oh, no, nah, he's out. That, that's, that's a great save, Emmy. Done absolute wonders there. We've lost the game, though. I mean, the defence is just so poor sometimes. We go down to Man United by one goal to nil. Played quite well, though, to be fair. I mean, look at that. I'm being honest. 7.5, man of the match, no goals, no assists. I genuinely think we were the best player on the pitch in that game. Uh, Dallow got a 7.3, gave us a bit of competition down the right, but they bought Ari Maguire in midfield. He was shocking, by the way. Um, but yeah, I think that's a thoroughly deserved man of the match. Back at Villa Park for this one. We're expecting a win against this Leicester side. We're on 19 points. And uh, we'll start with the first highlights in this big game. Do you want to make a run? Nice. Held up nicely. Play it back to Young. Go on, Young. In middle. Chance to shoot. Can we make it one? Yes, we can. And we hit them with the gritty because we are the maverick. That is horrendous. That goal celebration is disgusting. No, no, we do lead Leicester 1-0. And, uh, I mean, it's not a great goal. I'm not going to show many highlights this episode. But it's a uh, good start anyway. But like a deflection. We just, we just pass and move. Pass and move. Oh, go on. You're offside. Oh, no. You weren't offside. Woot face, he's been turned inside out, we've got a second. Do we do it again? Do we do it again? Oh no, I feel bad doing it, I really do. But Leicester deserve it for sacking Brendan Rodgers, to be honest. 2-0 Villa. I think that might be the final highlight. We've still got a chance to come forward here. Go on, I'll have it back. Hit one, thunder, hit one. Good save by Everson just before the end of the half. And I think Leicester will escape with a 2-0 deficit. 
Could be three or four. They've been woeful this first game. Oh my God. We've hospitalised past then. So a half an hour remaining. Look at the, the techers on me. I'm I'm mint. I'm mint, I'm gonna be honest. Right, look at the football here. We're transitioning numbers. Go on, I hold up the ball again. Look at Matty Cash, the Polish Cafu. Play it back. Goal of the season contender. What the hell are we doing? We are absolutely smashing this Leicester City team. And you know what? It's fully deserved as well. We're beating them by three goals still, and that's one of the goals of the season. Look at the transition from attack to defence. I defended the corner, got back up, and cemented a fine hat trick. Oh, passing now. Come on. Oh, great defending again. Let's preserve this clean sheet at all costs, really. We could do with it. Oh, what a result that is. 3 0 victory against Leicester City. Hat trick for Hayes Jr. And uh, look at collecting the match ball. As I say, guys, we are a maverick at the moment. Yet again, though, we get another win. This time away against Bournemouth, the Cherries at the Vitality. Danny Mota opens the scoring for Bournemouth and then Fagi Fagioli gets red carded. Imagine him leaving Juve for Bournemouth. And then Amduani, our strike partner, scores in the 38th and we grab the winner in the 69th <laughs> minute. That is absolutely fantastic. 9.2 for Amduani, 8.7 again for us. We're on fire at the moment. Oh, it is indeed a snap back to reality. It is in the first leg of the Carabao Cup. We're going to play the second. We lose 2-1 to the Hammers at uh, Villa Park. Skamaka and Fornell score for them. Amduani again scores. It's a poor game. We get six rating. And uh, we've got Blackpool next to the final simulation game of this episode. I'll tell you what, we need a win in that because Blackpool in the FA Cup round three is a pretty good draw. We do indeed beat the Seasiders by four goals to one. Amduani again continues impressive goal scoring. When we get two in this one, and Jacob Ramsey, our another young teammate, scores another goal. But yeah, 9.7 rating. Very, very good indeed, to be honest. Very good performance. And we threw to the FA Cup round four. But, more importantly, we've got another achievement we've made in this series. We are a back-to-back -back Player of the Month with a winner. Sorry, look at that. We've actually won November's Player of the Month and December's Player of the Month. We're absolutely on flames at the moment. We've been fantastic so far this season. We are in fact at Villa Park for this one. We've decided to play team highlight simulation. And uh, I mean, we've got Liverpool next. That's a boring point game. Let's see how we do against Spurs. Fairly big game. So Spurs get the first corner of the game in the 31st minute. Why do you get no chances on these? Surely like make it even, at least giving me some chances. I'm just going to bring Keeper out and claim it. Look how easy that were. Oh my God, that was not easy. We nearly conceded straight away. We have got a cross up between the 57th minute though. Um, Jacob Ramsey. That looks like a decent prospect. This is a chance. Right, pull it back. Go on. Finesse shot. Oh, it's blocked by Romero. Um, we're not really getting much at ball at the moment. Oh, come on. Come on. Find me. I've got Papa Man. Go on. Oh, we've made it one. Finally, we've scored. We've had barely any chance in this game, but we've made it 1 0 in the Villa Park Faithful. A loving life. 1 0 against Spurs. Cannot get near him. Oh, lovely. Two-man press. Is that the final attack of the game? Yes, it is. 1-0 victory against Tottenham Hotspur. We're doing so well so far. Another decent rating, 8.9. Man of the match yet again. Amduani and Martinez had very good games as well. Martinez kept us in it for a good chunk of that game. But we've got bigger fish to fry next. We've got Liverpool at Anfield. What a horrendous prospect this game's going to be. Oh, here we go. Anfield, what a stadium. What an atmosphere. Massive gaming prospect. Let's see who gets the rubber the green. Very difficult gaming coming. So we kick off against the mighty Reds. And um, I mean that is that as I say, guys, we're a maverick. We're an absolute maverick. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and go for it. Oh, get get down. That is maverick behaviour. We've absolutely wiped him out. Who is that? Is that Calabria? He's not happy with it. Let's see what the ref has to say about this. It's a oh, it's a yellow card, you know. That's what we do. We're aggressive. That is a that is an hard man challenge. Liverpool on the attack. Why are we on a 5.5? We've played well. God's sake, yeah. Good challenge, Matty. Thiago's got it back, though. Luis Diaz. Lucho pulls it back. It's a chance for Liverpool, and they take it with aplomb. Who is that who scored? That's a very nice finish, to be fair. Don't tell me it's Mikel Marino. Oh, it's Diogo Jota. 
Good goal. The Reds lead 1-0 at Anfield. Oh, what a, what a player. Pull it back. Go on, mate. Pull it back. We've scored. Easy goal. Easy goal. Liverpool make a disastrous defensive display. We make it 1-1. I'm not sure about the celebration, but myself and Amdoani are top Gs. We're back in the game. Great play. Fully merited, to be fair. Good good play there, running at him. I think Ramdouani won it. Yeah, thoroughly deserved. 1-1 now. Right, Liverpool. Jota. No, good defending. Tell you what, it's not the best first half in the world, but it's not bad at all. We got back level straight away after the kickoff. And uh, fully merited. 1-1. One, one. Oh, that's a lovely ball. Nah, they've scored. Salah don't miss these. Liverpool make it two. I already know because he's so clinical in real life and on FIFA. I tell you what, it's well worked, but it's probably my fault for losing the ball a bit further up the field. And he celebrates with Klopp and Liverpool lead again for the second time. Why am I at risk of being subbed off? I'm the only one who creates anything on this team. Right, I've got the ball. Nice. Just a quick reminder, we'll have FA Cup fourth round. It's good football though, isn't it? That it really is. Go on, Sunshine. Oh my god, he's absolutely thundered it past Allison. Jacob Ramsey with an absolute worldie. Puts us back level. Game on. Five minutes later. I've been subbed. I've been subbed. You are taking the mick, Henry. I'm the only one who's done anything in this game and you sub me. I bet we lose. You know what? I hope we lose. I'm gonna go that far. Go on, ask me the question. Do you want to simulate the rest of the game? I do actually, yeah. Let's see if I lose. I really hope we do because it's oh, proves proves him wrong. To be fair, that's really frustrating. Why did he take me off when we were doing so well? I got a seven point one. I got a goal. I'm Duane, somehow got a better rating, but it is what it is. I mean, we I didn't deserve that. I really didn't deserve to be treated like that by Emery. I'm furious with him. But anyway, we're gonna hold our tongue with Unai Emery. And uh, we're still in his starting eleven. We're still in his plans. We're the best bleeding player on the team at 75 rated. But yeah, we've uh, we've got quite a busy episode coming up in the next one. Um, hopefully out in two days. I think this will come out on the Sunday, so on the Tuesday. Um, poor manager performance. You yeah, what? The manager's under pressure now. I hope he is, you know, because he's winding me up. Um, I'm going to put Maverick points on. I don't care. I don't care about that manager. Gossip from the dressing room. Do one, Emery, you, you nugget. But yeah, this is what I meant. We need to request a new wage increase. We've got 11 more days to do it. That'll be the next episode. And uh, I mean, we deserve more than 30k a week with the former at the moment. To prove it, eight goals in five games in the Carabao Cup and 21 in 23 in the Premier League, which is eight more than Salah, nine more than St. Maximin and nine more than our rival Haaland. I'll also be in the top six for assists. So I mean, surely I deserve more than 28 and a half K a week. I I'm not happy with Emre, you know, guys. I'm, I'm gonna have a word with him in the next episode, I think. But anyway, in the next episode, as I say, we have got three opening difficult games, two in the cup, one against Fulham in the league. We're gonna send them two at the, like straight away in the start of the episode. I'm gonna play that one afterwards, even though they don't work like chronologically, just to have a bit of a flow of the two episodes. So play West Ham as the third game, then we'll play Arsenal, we'll sim the two against Palace and Wolverhampton and probably finish on a played game against Chelsea to put us into March firmly into the final, what's it called, furlong? I don't even know, final hurdle of the Premier League season. And uh, yeah, I've got about 12 games left in the league, so probably three episodes left. And uh, yeah, we'll be done then. Well, I mean, when I say done, we'll be in season three. But well, that is all we've got today, guys. I really appreciate you watching, as always. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. It will really help the channel out as I'm trying to hit a 1,000 subs. But uh, I'll catch you on another video on the channel very, very soon. Thank you very much. Cheers.